whatever their philosophical basis, whether Canadians or Conservatives or Liberals or New Democrats, I know there isn't the slightest bit of difference in terms of their commitment to the well-being of children. However else we may differ on other political matters, and the differences are real and serious, on this issue there is no difference. On the commitment to overcoming child poverty, I believe there would be no difference about the goal. We have the resources, we have the ability. We've done it before on pensions. We've done it before on Medicare. What we need now is to demonstrate the same will concerning the needs of our children. Quel sort de visage a la pauvreté? What sort of face does poverty have? Small babies, dangerously thin. It's death. Death of the babies. The babies of poor mothers die at a rate two times higher than the babies of wealthier mothers. Mr. Speaker, we can, we must take up our obligations now. We must show that for us human dignity is to be cherished as much in life's first pages as it is in the concluding chapter. I simply say it's time to match the rhetoric with action. For the sake of our children, let us find that same spirit of reform, of hope, of courage, of tenacious intelligence that has led this nation of ours to great accomplishments in the past. Let us affirm today in this parliament that as a nation, by the beginning of the 21st century, only 11 years away, child poverty in this great Canada will be a relic of the past. Thank you very much. <laughs>